In this video, I'm going to show you how you can lift the subject out of a photograph and how you can copy and paste that into another app on the iPhone. This was introduced with iOS 16. Let's go over to my iPhone. Let's go over to my Photos app. Now you can really use this feature or use this procedure from within any app. You do not have to use the Photos app as an example. But I have a couple of photos in my Photos app, so I'm going to show you how this works from the Photos app. So I tap on Photos here, and I have this photo here from Disney. Let's go ahead and tap on it. What I would like to do is take this foreground, this mountain here, this is Mount Everest over at Animal Kingdom. I would like to take that foreground and text it to someone. Maybe highlight that roller coaster. I want to lift it from the background. Well, all we have to do is just tap and hold on it. So I'm going to tap and hold on this, and you're going to see a little white line go through the foreground. Once that white line gets done, it's done analyzing the photo, and then you're going to be able to copy that foreground. So I'm going to tap and hold here. You're going to see the white line there. And now we can see as I move my finger around, I can move that foreground around. So let's say I wanted to put this into a message. How do I do that? Well, a couple of different ways I can let go and then you're going to see copy up here I copy it and now what I can do is go over to my messages app and then I can paste it when I tap on paste we can see we have that foreground I mentioned that there was a couple of different ways to do that well we can also use drag and drop on the iPhone so now what I'm going to do is delete this and we're just going to do this again. So I go back over to my Photos app. Now what I do, you do have to use two hands for this to work. I tap and hold. We can see I have my foreground. I'm still holding it, but now what I do is I swipe up with my other hand using my thumb. And now what I can do is tap on the Messages and I can drag it down to the Messages app. Let's take another look at this. This time we're going to lift the subject out of a photo and messages. Like I said, we do not have to use the Photos app to do this. This is a system-wide feature. So I'm going to go to my messages, and now I'm going to go to one of my conversations, and I have this image here of Beth and myself. What I would like to do is lift the foreground, lift Beth and myself out of that photo. And then what I'm able to do is move it into a new message as an example. So what I do is I tap on it, and now that it's open, I can tap and hold. And you're going to see I'm able to lift it out of there. I swipe up, and I can place it into a note as an example. And now that image is in a note. We're going to look at this one more time, but this time I'm going to look at it through my overhead camera. So then you can actually see how it works when I'm using drag and drop. So I'm going to delete this first of all here, because we're going to redo this again. And now I'm going to go to my overhead camera. So now let's go back over to my Messages app. So I tap on the Messages app. There is my photo. I tap on it to open it up. And now I tap and hold. And now you can see I'm lifting it here. I swipe up with my thumb. We're going to go to my Notes. I tap on it with my thumb and I just place that in my Notes app using drag and drop. Let's go back to my original where I went to my Photos app. I go to my Photos app. We're going to go back over to Mount Everest here. I tap and hold, and now I can lift it up. I can swipe up with my thumb, or I could use my other thumb here. I'm just going to swipe up. I go over to my Messages. I drag it down, and now that is in my Messages. So that's how we can use drag and drop as well as copy and paste. So that's how we can lift a subject out of a photo with the iPhone and iOS 16. We can do this by copy and paste, or if you really want to get creative, you can use drag and drop on the iPhone. Just tap and hold on an image. It does have to have a distinct foreground and background. This will not work on every photo. But just tap and hold on the photo, and then you're going to see a white line go through it, and then from there you can move it around, and you're just going to see that foreground. From there you can let go and copy it, or what you can do, again, to get real creative, is just use two fingers or your thumb and your index finger, 
and use drag and drop to move it around to different apps. So that's how you can lift the foreground out of the background of a photo on an iPhone with iOS 16.